How's it going, fellow Samuel Russian? This is another episode of Yakuza Kiwami, and in today's episode, what is happening here? This guy's like spitting on the ground. I think there's a particle effect coming from him. Anyway, in today's episode, we're gonna learn more moves from this motherfucker. And then, when we're done with that, we're gonna go and look for Haruka, who got kidnapped. Too fucking bad. Yeah, I did. I have two new Ugh. pictures for you, old man, and I probably won't bother to get more of them because to get more of them, I'll have to replay. What? Oh, I didn't trade the points. I forgot. Shit. Now we gotta go back to the Coliseum. Okay. Which doesn't necessarily mean I can actually have enough points to get two new pictures. I forgot this is not how it works. I for some reason thought that each tournament I won means I got one of the cards. That's not how it works. I gotta exchange the points I get in the Coliseums to get the cards. So I might actually have only enough points for one more of them. But I don't know. I'll have to see. Image of a snake. An image of a... Yeah, I give enough. Yeah, and I don't think we're gonna get more images. There's a lot of more images we could get. But to get them, like I said, I would have to replay the tournaments that I already already did, and I don't really feel like it. I quite possibly could do it when I would be like end game almost. Not end game, but like near the end of the game. Right. Would probably max out all my stats and shit, and I would just simply come back here, max out my stat. That guy's walking a dog. It's the first time I've seen anyone with a pet around this town. Oh. My prized poopoo, have you brought me the image of Snake? Yeah, this time I really did. Uh. Oh, you have the image of a snake, eh? Let's begin. I know one of the fights. Ah, oh, there uh. we go. Here your next opponent is this man. I wonder who could who could it be? He's even using the same model from when he was a bartender, except now he has a mask on. And it's funny because this devil he has on his face is actually with the tattoo on the back he also has. This man is called Hanya Man. I met him many years ago, far to the west. He came to Kamutro to do some sightings, so I have brought him here to see the size of the yeah. arena. Now I know what you want to ask, why did I bring him to Purgatory instead of some tourist attraction? Worry not, I shall take him to a pub or karaoke or some other Tokyo landmark after this, but you showed up, so... So yeah, he dances and does weird shit. You're awfully chatty today anyway, and this Hanyo man, he looks strangely familiar, like someone I met before many many times. Like someone who harasses me on the streets and tries to kill me at a fucking every day. Surely... Merely your imagination, right, Kanye man? Doesn't speak. Mm -hmm. Why are you so quiet? I'm actually surprised because Majima usually just talks a lot. Kanye man is a man of few words. He is a man of action. Even I have have a hard time remembering what his voice is like. Hmm. The training ends if you defeat Kanye man. So just do it. Oh man, I gotta fight him in the dragon style. This is fucked up. Look at his health bar, it's like really big. Who is Hanya Man and what is his connection to Komaki? Overcome the mysterious warrior as Komaki Price Poopoo. I, I mean, he uses the blue one, so it's not tough. But I just dislike the fact that I'm. that I'm forced to use dragon style, because dragon style just. shit. Oh, I can grab him too. Even Brawl has like a way better quick step. It seems like he's not even affected by my punches. I can do this cool shit though. Just saw me do like a backflip and then come back into action. No, he's ungrabbable, right? I can't even chain like a proper combo, I don't have enough moves. 
just have like a four button scramble and that's it. Not have to beat him with that. At the beginning of the game, yeah, when I hit Dragon, it was pretty cool. Because I hit it maxed out. But now I don't. It kinda sucks. I hope next games don't have it that I get to do some stupid task to unlock Dragon. I hope Dragon is just another ability I can simply upgrade. By the way, we have like three healing items left, so I better not fuck it, fuck it up too much. Why does this heat even matter? I can't do any cool things. I just tried to pull off a finishing move while grabbing him. It didn't work. down the green bar so far. And he gets like two health bar on top of that. Oh and I'm getting my ass kicked. Oh come on. This fight sucks, I hate it. The dragon has some flashy moves, but who cares when it sucks? So how did Majima get involved in that? Does he really seriously know with every single move I do? I'll tell you a story why I fight this motherfucker. I almost ran over a dog yesterday when I was driving my car. I was driving on the road, right? And the guy in front of me apparently... I think that's what happened, I'm not sure. I was more looking at the car in front of me than the road. But the guy in front of me seems to have hit a dog. And then he drove away. And then I noticed the dog underneath his car. And I was like, oh shit. So I quickly dodged it so I wouldn't just ran it over even more. And I think the lady like, on the side walk next to the road, I think she was the owner. She looked pretty distressed. And then I felt bad, like, should I have stopped maybe and helped her out? I don't know how the fuck would I help her out. Fucking resurrect her dog. I'm a fucking necromancer. Rip of the necrodancer. This fight is stupid. If I had brawl, I would do the like, cool shit and grab him every once in a while and try to throw him around, but with this fighting style I can do shit. I lost all my heat. I lost all my health. I'm gonna lose more heat. More health. It's not a bad moment to drink one of those. I can't do anything else because I don't have any other moves. Yes, I do have some kind of quick kick move. Do I have like a combo when I press triangles? No. I do not. I just have like one kick. By the way, I like how Majima dresses up in this mask. Then he doesn't. Oh, he's just said a thing. So much for not talking. Dumb shit. Wow, I just did some cool thing and I missed it. That's great. I hope the orange shell bar that goes down in like one hit, I swear to god. The worst thing is that the max... I don't know how many health bars are. I've seen a fight with this like legendary enemy, the one at the end of the game. And he has like f five health bars. That's on top of each other. And it looks so stupid, like you, he has a purple health bar. You take down the purple health bar, you reveal that he has a grey health bar underneath. Then underneath that one he has like another one. 
then on the random it's like an, yet another one. It's like how many layers of health more does this motherfucker have? It's not even like the colors are progressing like I don't know, along the coast of rainbows I can tell how many. It's kind of fucking <laughs> Gotta say, if I hit this cool stand-up move, if I hit my in my brawl ability, that would that would be cool. So a lot of skills I unlock in brawl, like finishing moves and other things I have, actually shared between brawl and dragon. Brawl and dragon are pretty similar. In fact, I believe the original Yakuza. The I'm not sure if actually. Why, why isn't it working? I can't do a fucking heat action. He just regenerated health. Oh my god. I hit heat, why didn't he? Oh come on, he could do it. But I can't do a single move. Can't do anything, it just says punch. Do this thing over and over until he fucking dies. I'm sick of this shit. I obviously can't change my fucking fighting style. This is supposed to teach me dragon moves, but dragon moves are shit. Oh yeah, to do a finishing move, yeah, cool. Well, I couldn't even do one when he was fucking unconscious for a second. Everybody just gets behind you like that. They do it all the damn time and I can't even turn around when I'm getting my ass kicked. Ah, oh, cool, thanks. Fuck, all of a sudden he's talking so fucking ridiculous. Oh, come on. And behind me. And I got my ass kicked. I can predict future. Look, I'm gonna not even finish my combo. He's gonna get behind me. Yeah, it happens every time. Sick of this fucking shitty ass fight. Oh my god, the whole combo just on my back. I. Why can't I just fucking do anything besides my shitty ass like four hit combo? Am I doing dragon style wrong? It's a possibility that I'm doing it wrong. I honestly don't fucking know anymore. As soon as I let go of the block, you just hit me. Pull off a move. What is this? Really? One more healing fucking potion. I obviously can't fuck it up too much. All the purgatory showed up and fucking watch me fight Magica. I could start scheduling this fight so people could pay for tickets. You wanna fight Magima? Fight Kiryu again? Children's favorite pastime. Last health bar and my last potion. I better not fuck it up. This health bar is not going down faster than the other ones. Maybe because Dragon is a piece of shit and I'm not using that fighting style for purpose. It sucks. He sucks too, and I don't like it. I think I might like Dragon a little more than Beast. That doesn't mean it's better. Yeah, in the corner, cool. Wish I could, I don't know, corner him. But no, he just gets behind me, teleports. Like some Dragon Ball or something. Like he just all of a sudden teleport like this. I mean, some things in this fucking game are kind of like a straight up Dragon Ball. 
and punching a guy in the air and punching him like a million times and he's not even touching the ground. Motherfucking, I can't even dodge that. I thought it would go way faster. I'm gonna spend the whole episode just fighting this motherfucker. Usually in Brawl it's pretty easy to beat, but this is ridiculous because I can't use the dragon style. Oh my god, no. I'm gonna lose this. If I lose this shit, I don't care. Oh no, come on! Like, what, what am I supposed to do now? Can I pull out a weapon, maybe? I, I can't. I'm gonna run away. I'm gonna tire him. <laughs> I don't know what to do. And what, I can't do a finishing move to it. And he's just regaining health. Yeah, because he needs to regain health. He has so little health. Really did need it to regain it. Give him a fair chance. It's like he's fucking kicking my ass relentlessly and not even giving me a chance. Motherfucker, I would beat him if I wasn't fucking forced to use this shitty dragon style. Uh, can you guys use dragon style properly? Can you tell me what the fuck I'm doing wrong? I lost it's about to fucking happen. There you go, I lost. I think this is my first loss in the whole game. Actually, maybe not. Quite definitely not. Well, I lost. Go fuck yourself. Is this gonna count either way? I don't know. How about it, Kiryu? Hanya Man is one few men I could consider truly strong. Perhaps the dragon within you is awakening. Hmm, it seems to have been effective. In that case, I shall teach you the. Oh, never mind, I'll learn it anyway. So, what do you tell me? I could just stand there and get my ass kicked and now the fucking past? Attack increases it against strong enemies while using the dragon of Dojima style. I could have. Couldn't beat him, so why are you teaching me anyway? This training was more about facing an essential dangerous enemies, not about winning or losing. <laughs> what do you mean? What matters is that sudden clash against a strong foe. You cannot win if you can't rise to meet an emergency, especially against a warrior as skilled as Hanya Man. Listen, you shall face incredibly strong foes in the future. When that happens, you will need to power restraint. You'll need the power resting within you. The dragon must rise of new heights to match any challenge. <laughs> I look forward to seeing what strong enemies you'll face in the future. For the present, though, your training is done. Next, the image of whatever. That's what I require. Uh. So I did it anyway. Majima everywhere. Well, I guess, spoiler, who was the fucking Hanya man? Thanks, game. I was looking forward to solve that mystery. Mm hmm? What do you think? I have high expectations for him. I felt an outstanding potential from him. One that surpasses even your own. What? It looks like you already had your eye on him. Long ago, I planned to make you my student and teach you the moves of my school. But your path took a different turn. So I'll train this man in your steed and teach him all that the Komaki staff has to offer. So we're gonna make him stronger, eh? Now you're talking my language, old man. Now I'll be looking forward to it. <laughs> looking forward to it? I expect no less from you, really. You should come and see me every once in a while. You've grown rusty with your passing years. I could help you retrain. Maybe I'll drop by if I'm feeling it. Or not. Anywho, I'll catch you on the flip side. You old fogey. 
fucking apparently he's his old master. That's interesting. Thanks for not I don't know recharging my health bar. I'm just gonna walk like this for the rest of the episode. By the way, there's nothing I can use to heal myself. So I'm gonna fucking die. I have the image. Yeah, it brought me the image. Great. It's the last one I'm gonna bring you. So you better be appreciative of that. This session is something you actually expect in training. That's unusual for you. Am I gonna stand under a waterfall? Mm -hmm. <laughs> ah, great. Well, I'm gonna have to get shot in the chest. You plan to be a monk in the mountains? Nothing of the sort. You're gonna be dodging the bullets I shoot at you. Hey, you're not actually packing heat, are you? <laughs> Worry not. This is a real gun, but you're made out of steel. I've heard. Uh. Okay. Are you ready? The training will be complete when you dodge all the bullets in the time. So just do it. Just do it. I strangely feel like the the timing when he shoot when he aims at me and then shoots is a little is a little off. Like I have to like half second after it says the thing and aims at me. Might be fucking giving me a fair chance because of like how long it would take him to you know move his arm a little bit to the side. 30 seconds of being under fire and also not being able to get hit. Not because they will fail the challenge, because I just don't have any fucking help left. Avoid bullets and shit, but it's not like I'm gonna probably stand like this in a boss fight. Well, that was close. In a boss fight. <laughs> Shot me. Thanks. It's funny because he's like, he said, like, oh, I'm firing blanks. I have rubber bullets or whatever he said. I didn't read it. But if he had blanks or rubber bullets, he still could have fucking hurt me. Mm hmm? And like blanks or blanks. Remember that I think it was actually Bruce Lee's son who, on a set on a, of a movie, I don't know what fucking movie, he had a gun loaded with blanks, and he was like, "Oh, it's just blanks," and he pointed it to his gun, pulled the trigger, and he killed himself because it was blanks. But that doesn't mean shit. It still fired right in his head. It just doesn't shoot like a normal bullet. It kind of just like you know shoots out of the barrel, but not like properly. It just kind of spreads like whatever. Evade and strike. I evade your enemy attack and strike with a counter. You may already know how to use a similar skill, but our style version of the move is distinctly more powerful. Really, the damage it does to enemies vital is on another level. We shall see it when you see the move in actual combat. Got it. Next thing I need is the image of drama. Which is the prize of the arena. Bring it here. Nah. I'm not feeling it, old man. I almost lost my life today. I think I'm gonna pass, thank you. I think I'm actually gonna pass out. To be more precise. You think if I'll run in a fight, I'll manage to get to a store to heal myself? It's like the closest thing I could heal myself with. Cause we gotta go and find Haruka. And I have no idea where to look for her. She's in... There's like, all of a sudden the city's full of these gangsters. And they're all dressed in different colors. There's the blue gang, the red one and the white one. I believe... Uh, the red one's kidnapped. Her, I don't remember, but it doesn't matter because I'll have to find out anyway. Let's ask this guy. Mm -hmm. I'm sure I'm not really home or something on a large scale. This guy's a Yakuza? He looks like a fucking idiot. That's why so f That's way too fucked up. But the explosions was intentional. Unbelievable. Okay, this guy's supposed to be Yakuza. Please don't attack me, I have like no health. Fuck 
fucking Majima's already around. Fuck me. These guys are gonna kill me. Run, clear you. Now you're hungry. I heard. But try and run. I can't outrun them. I'm walking way too slow. Blue Z. Cool name. One hit and I'm dead. Oh, another guy came out of nowhere. Seriously, really quick, we gotta make is that fucking restaurant to eat something. You know where I also might have might want to go because I haven't figured it out before but now I know how to do it I might go to Meb which is a uh, like an information place where I can gather info and I gotta gather info on a club named Shine Shine on put your babe let's fucking go in this place they sell some good steak kills for a lot of health and also looks kinda tasty. Well, I decided. No, I have not fucking decided. I'll have this. Ho ho. Yeah, that looks good. Four million. It's a lot of money. I guess I didn't waste it as much money as I did in the first place, where I would just buy like random weapons and try to use them in combat and I would just mess around with them. What am I even supposed to look for? I think if I stand still, Kiryu will like tell me what to do. They look hard, I'll find her. If I can search every girl, I'll find her. Great. Okay. Great. Just what I actually, you know what? The guy in the theater avenue place, he probably knows where to look. Let's uh, go here really quickly. Fuck up those guys too. Come on, fight me. <laughs> what, what happened to this guy? Glasses? You can see me? Oh yeah, those are clones. Yeah, there's two of the same guys. Ouch. That pathetic knee kick in the back. Probably take me down if I ever eat anything. I actually made you dragon if the dragon wasn't so fucking annoying. And maybe I would use beast if beast wasn't so slow. Okay, this guy has info on all the cute Asian chicks in the city, I guess. Look at these fucking wallpapers, that's ridiculous. When it comes to the city nightlife, leave it to me, I'll show you all the best spots. Tell me about Shine. There's a cabaret club down in the pink street, lots of joints down there tend to overchange, but you don't have to worry about this with Shine. All the girls there are fantastic, they especially recommend meeting with Rina Chan. Uh, no thank you. How about you fuck off, I found a card. Okay, how many? Oh, I got 30. 30. Ah, oh, shit. I think I need 40 to actually finish the, the quest line. With the Mesa King card game. It's running around all the city. White edge. Thank god there's no green gang. Stop you. Bad fighting them. Ouch. These guys are wearing blue underneath. Raiders. So these guys are way tougher than like street ruffians or street gangsters and other people like that. Well, not way tougher, but they're a little tougher. You know, I can still fuck them up pretty good, but. Oh, 
Oh, he broke my penis. Let's shine again. What are you guys? You guys looking for trouble? No. Oh. Get the fuck out of the street. All these fucking salary man. You got something cool? Boom, everything exploded at once. Did you already see it? Fire at the purgatory? Yeah. Hold on. Cell phone. It's like a quest from Nishida. Ah, see? I better go to the map to gather information. I just been to meds. Let's go there again. I wanna, I wanna watch strippers. Well, I remember when GT4 came out, I... My, like, every fucking mission activity would just go to a strip club. Watch strippers. And the funniest part was that in the strip club they also had these fucking... Tetris arcade machines. I was like a 3D Tetris where you could flip the blocks in all the directions. It was actually kind of a fun game. Like it could have been good enough to be a standalone Tetris game instead of being a mini game in GT4. Tell me about Shine and Take Me There. How about it? Let's go on a date. If this guy seriously just has to fucking lead me there? I couldn't go there myself? Does, will this trigger some kind of mission? Here we are, Rina-chan is good girl. Show her a good time and she'll make sure you have one too. Is Rina-chan actually Majima-chan? I feel like I triggered a mission. The service of I don't care really. I'm rich. I wanna have a good time, I just got beaten pretty badly and I don't really know what the fuck to do with the story. Well, that's not Majima. Actually, who the fuck knows, it could be him. I'm Rina, nice man spreading, haha. <laughs> Seriously, look at the way he sits, he owns the fucking couch. I have a love meter. Use my business card. Did I trigger a mini game? Ah, you know what? I think the other club, the, the Stardust one, not the Stardust one, the. There's another club. That one has strippers. This one is actually like me on a date. Kiryu Kazuma. Kiryu Kazuma. Kiryu. I love his deep voice because this is actually how the fucking voice actor sounds. Unlike Solid Snake, Geralt, or fucking Red Heart, or they, they have fucking shitty deep voices. Duke Nukem kinda has a shitty deep voice too because Duke's problem with his deep voice, in my opinion, like, yeah, he sounds cool when he's pissed off and all, just talking normally, but when he tries to express any kind of emotion, especially you could see that in Bulletstorm if he plays him. When he's trying to act worried, he just sounds ridiculously stupid. And Postal Dude, Postal Dude's voice also pretty cool because that's also how the voice actor actually sounds. <laughs> Curious sound, it's nice to meet you. Yeah, it is nice to meet me. Not many girls get to meet me. You reminded me of my dead, murdered in a gunfight or tortured to death old friend. Would you like to drink? Hmm. Should I go for like the most expensive shit? Hmm. I mean, it, it is really expensive. I'd go for like this. I go for beer, orange juice. What is so true? Oh no. Ah, I'm gonna go for like this. Yeah. Champagne. I want this. Awesome. Give it to me. Oh really? You have a lot of money? I think I've fallen in love. Experience point. Ooh, nice glasses. Just fucking drink it all down in one fucking go. She looks at me. Oh, I never hit that in my life. 
何かスポーツとかされてたんですか no, I kill people, do you? Not、really. Yeah, maybe you were in prison for 10 years and there's nothing really to do in prison other than just fucking work out. Maybe it's a good fucking training. Like, if you want to lose weight and get built, just go murder someone and go to prison for like 10 years. You'll be fucking small when you come out. You might not get a job anymore, but whatever. Then the. You work out, please. You play any sports? Yeah, I play an instrument. Is that a sport? <laughs> well, she got all sad, like, that she doesn't play sports. Is she disappointed? You don't fall a sport here. Are you new here? Or just a random compliment? You dumb bitch. Wanna be my good lover for life? How did you know? <laughs> Hmm, that's a that's a good point, Kiryu. I actually didn't thought of that. Wow, you're a detective too. Kiryu-san, the Kabakura no Tatsujin? Cabaret connoisseur? No, I'm not any kind of pervert. The stars are pretty routine stuff. Every time I meet a new girl, she asks the same fucking thing. Where can't she have my children? I'm sick of it. <laughs> Maybe you can. What's your job anyway? Do people in Japan really go to clubs to have a date with a random girl that they hired to have a date with? Ooh. Why did you choose to work here? My dad. Oh. Okay. It's kind of like show business. Yeah, I'm not sure if you're a lesbian. 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 It's the one in the story. I mean, my son worked there, right? I mean, my fake son, the guy I called my son, but he actually wasn't. So that's why I became a hip hostess. I hear a lot of girls working here. Something but working here for the girls, that's the first. So you're into girls. Hi, I'm a girl. I'm Look, happy pappy. Like the one I ran over with a car yesterday, two days ago. I didn't run it over, the guy in front of me did. I managed to dodge it. Come to think of it, I knew a guy in the joint who enjoyed being around all the guys. He seemed to love every minute of being there. Who, Majima? He seems to love being around me. Ooh. Oh, that's right. But it's not really appropriate to be looking at them in that way. Ever been to a man's changing room? Just, I mean, I did. Like after, after fucking swimming possessions in like a couple of years ago, when I actually used to fucking do sports. It's fine because we're all girls. It's all good. I almost got her to fall in love with me. I almost got her fucking wet. But I failed it? Don't do anything. I give her a present. I don't. Ah, oh shit. How about I own the order of fucking. What would I like to order? <laughs> I guess I could go for the school one. Done. I want this. Almost. Almost got with her. Cabaret Club pay pretty well. Not only I get to be around cute girls, but I make good money. This is heaven. 
joke this <laughs> yeah, but if you don't get requested you could get fired I'm pretty screwed if that happens. How could I deal with a normal job for being here in my dream job? I only came to this club because Nishida told me to. Because there was a girl who wanted to meet me especially. And if she didn't, then she wouldn't work for anyone else. And I have to talk with her now, I guess. Maybe after I'm done with talking with her, I can talk to the other girl. I want I should start putting away as much money as I can. I guess maybe a camera isn't in the cards after all. A camera? That's an interesting hobby. Yeah. I'm not sure porn artists do. It's trendy to have an SLR camera. The pictures are higher quality than anything you could take on a cell, and you just look like a mature professional photographer. Maybe she's uh, one of those fucking. So I heard e-girls. I don't know who the fuck are those. And to be honest, I don't even fucking wanna know. They, they seem like trouble. But if you've been hard to save up for, it'll be waiting. It'll be a while before I can take the plunge. Why not? I thought you get paid pretty well. Sure, but I got pretty sloppy with my money too. Oh hell a cab just to go down the street. And I stopped carrying around the late fees of the videos I rent. Who the fuck even rents videos anymore? Yeah, this thing takes place in 2005, I forgot. Just take a long, you gotta spend it to make it. It means you don't really want it. I don't know, all of them sound like shitty advices. Like you don't really want it. No, she really wants it. Just take out a loan, that doesn't sound like a good idea, she's already in debt, and she's low in money, and now she's gonna be even shittier. You gotta spend it to make it, sounds like the best option. <laughs> Being broke. If you walk instead of taking a cab, you will get tired. If you're worried about late fees, you'll feel rushed to finish those videos. Right now you're reading a worry-free... あ、確かに。あれかなくなってから、ちょっと体が楽になりましたし、深夜に慌てて返却に行くこともなくなりました。どうだ。Wait a minute. Did I chose the right option? Why can I talk like this to girls in real life? Oh, because I haven't even tried. That's why. <laughs> if I go broke doing it, you'll help me out, right? I will? Oy, oy. I mean, I'm sure I will. I already got fooled by a girl with huge titties one time, but your titties aren't as huge, and you seem cuter than she was, so I'm gonna believe in you. Ask her out, ask her out. Why isn't it working? Fuck. Uh talking. I don't fuck I wanna stop doing this. I didn't know it was gonna be like a talk with her, blah blah blah. I should keep talking. Keep talking, I guess. What is she gonna ask us about now? It's gonna be like Kirisa, Do you happen to know how to get rid of a body? When girls get together, we often talk about where to eat. But food, huh? Guys do that too, huh? <laughs> like I wanna eat you right now, so when I got to the place they recommended, that's all fine and dandy, but I wanna be able to recommend restaurants once in a while too. What? You don't know that many places to eat? Hmm, I guess not. I'm kind of a person who has to go to restaurants, so I never have a reason to try something we're new. That's why I'm always doing to the same places and never actually expand my knowledge of up and coming restaurants. Well, if you don't, if you go to the place you don't know, you'd run into the risk of. It'll suck. I can understand wanting to stick to the usual spot. But I feel like I should try to have different restaurants even if I pick the occasional stinker. What kind should I go to? Somewhere with a big buffet, somewhere with sweet treats, somewhere with tasty ramen. 
somewhere with a big fat, go with quantity over quality. Just like my YouTube channel. Ah, uh, so jokes are the best. I know it's kinda like that, but what the fuck? I don't really I don't know, I I, I like the fucking way it is. I'm making videos, I don't fucking have to sit and edit them and like cut out the boring parts and shit like that because that will take me way longer. I don't have that kind of time, so I don't even I'm not even usually cutting up anything from the videos. Very rarely I'm like speeding up the video or doing something because it just like I recorded just I don't know like in GTA 5 there was this episode where I was like running around the desert for like 30 minutes because I was doing a mission that had me do that and I speeded up the footage to like f 7 minutes I forgot about buffets girls care about cutting costs so we planned love to hear out about good deals I read that sentence all wrong it didn't even make any sense a good restaurant would maintain quality even a buffet I'd love to know a place that got lots of cheap food the best part is that the buffet has such a variety, you get, get to try stuff you wouldn't find in normal restaurants. <laughs> can, we, can I just go? Who is, what is happening? Why is he kneeling? I had enough drinks. I'm good to go. Very good, sir. Why is, got, why, why is he kneeling? Oh, fuck. That's a lot of money. That's a lot of money I blew to talk to a cute girl. She was pretty cute though. Please come again. Yeah, I like your request from now on. Really? Then I'll be waiting. I... I didn't even came here for that. I came here for a completely different reason. Also, isn't this game's plot about looking for my girlfriend, who's been missing? Why would I just start cheating on her with a different girl? I don't know, I don't care. Next episode, we're gonna go to a strip club and watch some tits. So see you fellas in the next episode, bye.